Hey guys, this is Abhishek from GadgetSkills.com and today we are going to do the full review of the UC browser which we have already preloaded on this device. UC browser is a third party browser which you get for Android, which you get for iOS as well as you can install it on Windows phone as well. This is how the browser looks like. We are right now uh, have opened our website into the full screen browser. Basically you can have full screen browsing experience into this browser. There is no problem. As far as kinetic scrolling is concerned, you also get a virtual scroll bar as well when you browse a web page. When it comes to page to zoom, page to zoom is pretty fluid within this browser, there is no issue. When it comes to double tap to zoom, double tap to zoom does not work within the browser. Although panning is pretty okay, there is no issue with the panning. And you can also play YouTube videos within the web page into this browser without any problem. And let me just show you the settings and options. So this is where the address bar will show. So you have the address bar over here where you can actually type the URL of the website which you would like to visit. Apart from this, let me just go back to the normal mode and you have the option of sharing the URL which you have opened into this browser. You can also scan a QR code in case you want to open a web page by scanning a QR code. You have clipboard, you have the option of taking a screenshot of a particular web page which you have opened. You can resize what you would like to capture in that screenshot. This is also a good feature. You can also capture a full screenshot as well. You also can enable the speed mode into this browser which will again fetch the data in much faster way and it will load the web page much faster and saving the data consumption charges as well onto this device wherever you are using the UC browser. Let me just show you some other options. You do have the normal controls like back and forward, number of tabs you have open, you can go to the home page. Under general settings you have the option of adding a home bookmark for a specific page you can go to the bookmarks in history you can enable the night mode as well in case you are using the browser in night mode uh, on your bed lying on your bed basically in that case you can also use it in this way and you can always revert back to the normal by just tapping over here and this is pretty quick i would say you do have different themes as per which you can enable the night mode or the classic mode you can also add different wallpapers in case you want to so this is another good option you also have the option of accessing the downloads the files which you have downloaded with this browser so this browser will allow you to download the files just like you do on your desktop browser you can always exit the full screen as well and here under tools you have some more options like you can find a specific word within a web page using this option you can also track over the data usage uh, with this browser so it will keep a track of the data usage whenever you are using it so then you don't exceed with your data bandwidth limit as far as 3g or the connectivity concerned you can update the browser you can give the feedback uh, you have the preferences like settings brightness you can control whenever you are using this browser and when it comes to other settings you can also have the option of fit to screen so basically it will fit the web page as per the screen uh, resolution at which you are running this browser you do have the scroll option which you can enable and disable you can actually enable these options in case you want to see them you can use the volume keys as well the volume rocker over here to scroll uh, the web page in case you want to so you now you will have these options which you can again move as well uh, whenever you are you browsing a web page when it comes to some other options you have rotation mode enabled you can specify in which mode the browser should actually render a web page that is also something which you can do so let me just load the website as of now and show you some of the features so just when we have loaded this website and if i go and specify the rotation to landscape it will automatically convert into landscape and even if I hold the device like this it will not rotate the view. You can always scroll down the web page with the help of these buttons which are there on the display when you are using this browser. So in all this browser is pretty good in terms of the overall functionality it offers. It does give you a large number of options. It, uh, it can help you with the file downloads as well in case you want to download files from web pages uh, using this browser you do have a large number of options and you do have different number of themes night mode is also supported so in all this browser is pretty good i would say i would like to give a thumbs up to this browser we will highlight some specific features of this browser in day-to-day -day usage scenarios later on that's all from us uh, we really like this browser do let us know if you have any specific questions for this browser we would love to help you for the uc browser 
you can like this video if this video helped you by clicking the like button below you can subscribe to our youtube video channel for more videos like this by clicking the subscribe button below thanks for watching this video this is abhishek signing off thank you